Okay, doesn't it feel like the world of AI is just kind of exploded and taking over? I, I, I get it. There's some of you that believe that Terminator 2 was actually a documentary, not a real movie. <laughs> I liked it. I'm not quite there with you. Well, Canva, Canva, the best graphics program out there by far, not even just for solo content creators like me, but it's just so stinking easy, has just released their own AI writing tool. It's called Magic Write. I've got early access to it. I'm excited. I don't know how I got selected, but I hit yes, I'll take it. And I want to give you a demo of what I've already found just playing with it. And it's pretty cool. Not totally accurate, but pretty cool. But let's jump in and let me show you what I found. Okay, so we're in Canva. Notice it's it's sparkling right there. I, I guess it's saying, hey, it's new. Check it out. So when I hit Docs, now there's a couple of different ways you can get to this. You can scroll down here. And again, this is this is part of one of their upgrades, the Docs, which I got to say is, is really cool. At first, I was like, yeah, whatever. And then I tried it. But today, we want to try this magic right. So we're just going to create a blank document. This is only one way you can get to it. So you go up here and there's a prompt, but when you click this magic, right? So let's do this. Let's put uh right. Oops. Uh, right. Uh, three tips about, uh, YouTube. Probably not. There we go. Research your topic thoroughly before creating videos as will help you create more engaging and interesting content. Have a consistent upload schedule to keep your audience engaged and use a variety of content types. Okay, so let's try something else. Now, it looks like with every prompt, you hit magic right. And I don't know if everybody has access to this yet. I hope you do. Uh, let me say five titles for YouTube video about, let's say, live streaming. Live stream 101, everything you need to know. You know, that's not bad. How to live stream like a pro. Okay. Get started with live stream beginner's guide. So you could see where you could use some of these, right? So let's say uh, Magic Right. Let's um, um, tell me five things about video podcasts, let's say. So you can kind of see it's thinking, it's thinking. All right, here we go. Uh, video podcasts are a great way to share and consume content. They can provide entertainment uh, content. Uh, video podcasts can be expanded viewers. So, you know, I mean, is this exactly how I would talk? I don't know. But look, you could turn this into a blog post or many different things. So let's, um, let's do this. How about um, YouTube intro for video about Facebook? Uh, groups. I don't know. We'll just make something up. Hey there, I'm excited to create a YouTube channel intro for your video about Facebook groups. Okay, that's probably not what you would say. I'm confident my design will capture the attention of viewers and may... Okay, so I'm not that impressed with that. But this is actually pretty cool. So I'm wondering, could you use it for... Let me see. Um, let's say three tips about being confident on camera. Let's just see what it comes up with. Uh, oh, here it is. It, it didn't break. Uh, so practice uh, speaking in front of a mirror to get more comfortable. You know what? That's that's not a bad tip. Take deep breaths and focus on the positive before you start recording and focus on the message you're trying to convey. Be sure to look up into the camera when you're speaking. Well, that makes sense. Like right now I'm looking. So you can kind of get an idea. I mean, it's not bad. I You know, it's probably going to get a little better now. Here's what you can do, though. When you come up here, you can convert it. So you can actually make it into a deck. Well, that's that's kind of cool. You can all... Oops, I didn't want to do that. We don't want to share that. But like all things on Canva, then you can do different things. So I can copy link. I can download it. So A4, that's just the document size. So when I download it, it's going to be a document that I've got. And then I can do something with it. There it is right there. Um... And if I, let me see if I can do this, pull it into here. And there's the document. It's like a PDF. So it is pretty cool because then you could turn this into a blog post or whatever. So there it is, magic right on Canva. So what did you think? I mean, it's not perfect, but it is a really cool tool to have. And I like that it's part of Canva because that's my go-to graphics tool for everything. By the way, if you want to check out Canva for yourself, there's a link down in the description. I'm on the pro plan, so I get access to 
everything. Hey, I hope you got something out of this. If you did, give it a like and share it away if you want to. And remember to keep creating because the world needs you. See you next time.